Okay, uh, welcome back to my LP in the last episode. Uh, we uh, kind of went to the ruins of Town Sandy, and this episode we're going to uh, kind of go to what's called the mines. Uh, I actually accidentally completed the level, and for some reason my recording device did not capture it well. So I got all the collectibles are there already, but I don't remember how to do this. You can select any level and go there. So for example, we can go here. Yeah, we'll go here. I'm not sure if all of the collectibles will still be there or not. The ones that I've collected when going through initially, but uh, I will definitely highlight where they are in this level. But anyway, we are going to the Fetching Forest. Rescue the Queen of the Mermex. Apparently she was kidnapped. And, uh, this one play, I like to play Sandy You're usually. Spooky. Aww, don't worry, Patrick. We'll protect you. Uh, I don't know why, just, she's not my go-to person. Let's go keep collecting everything. And actually, now that I'm redoing this level, I might be able to get some more uh, designs for characters now. <laughs> not sure, but I still need more crystals as well, so it's kind of a win-win situation. I'm redoing a level, but like... Hopefully I can still kind of easily highlight where things are and where they were. What's this? It looks like some sort of spider silk. It tastes like cut candy. There's more over there. Oh, it's like a trail. Of cut candy. Okay, whenever I see this scene, I think I always think of two things. I think of one, it's like an alien invasion. That's basically what it kind of looks like. And two, I always think of the scene in The Matrix where, uh... Neo is introduced to reality and what the robots are actually doing to the humans. This kind of reminds me of that scene. I almost kind of wonder if they did that on purpose. So let's actually climb up here first. There's actually a collectible up here we're about to get. Oh, we never know. You get lots and lots of crystals. And up here are our new enemies we're gonna be fighting now. They're kind of like guard-like guys. Kill the fucking bulls. There we go. Now we're in good shape now. So this is where you find one item for Tucker. It's uh, a radio tower kind of thing, and then we unlock the movie theater after getting that one right there. So that's where it's located, it's where these guards are. So, let's go back to of course. We got all the collectibles in this level before, so. Once again, I apologize for kind of like computer not recording it. Like, it recorded most of it, but then second half of the level was really glitchy and stuff, and laggy, and so it didn't record very well, and I figured it'd be better. Um, Looks like some kind of mine up ahead. So, it's not that long a level anyway, so it's not too bad. So let's go get all of the crystals here. Hop on down. Ooh, I can do that. You want to hop on the platform, make it easier to jump down, but you can. If you're good enough, you can just hop down like that, but not have the best luck with that today. This is the weirdest day I've had since last week. So before we go down, we the collectible level two actually. I never thought plants could be so evil. So right here, unlocked his art gallery yet? And up in here was a collectible for Timmy, I believe. And, uh, let's see. It was the rule book on the top. Level. Uh, Tucker thing was at the top right, and then we'll get that one last thing later here in the level. And that's all the collectibles. Like, really, they think it's kind of hand them to you right away, so it's not too terribly difficult to find. So let's hop down and fight some of the bad guys. Oh, uh, that's not fair. You totally did not deserve to get me there. Oh, 
There we go. The health and all the cl nice collectibles. Like an eagle. There we go. Alright, uh, we have moving platforms here. We gotta kind of jump on. We have to get more weight from this platform. And here it comes. Here, let's not be too close to the edge. It was the easiest way to fight these guys is to knock them off the edge a little bit. There we go. Don't bother fighting them. It's not worth it. Be careful not to over hit, otherwise you'll actually fall right off the platform. I did that multiple times the last time I did this. <laughs> there we go. And of course, we gotta get all the way up to the top. Alright, I'm not gonna get all the discs because we have enough discs already, I believe. So I'm not gonna go for all these discs. But make sure to go to this path over here. Across. There we go. Let's kinda go across this little platforming area. And then right here is where we got Sam's, I think, dumpster or whatever, whatever it was. She's uh, an eco person, so <laughs> makes sense for her. Get all these we can. Kind uh, tricky. There we go. Head back where we came from. It's like a holiday. Yeah. What happens if I try to rush? Well, it's like bugs is waiting, eagerly waiting for us. There we go. Stun him. Let's keep moving. Nothing to see here. <laughs> Giant blades? Who built this thing? Indeed. There, there really isn't, for a machine that's, for what this machine is doing, there's literally no point for blades at all, whatsoever. There we go. Not too terribly difficult. And it's all fine. So I guess this is kind of like a shield, I believe is what it does. I'm not quite sure what it does. Um, I don't know. Or maybe it reduces damage by half or something, I don't know. I'm not quite sure. Back here. I don't know where everyone else is at right now, but I'm just leading the way. Get all the crystals that we can. Nice, Sandy. <laughs> also, be careful on these platforms, because if you stay too long on these platforms, they're going to give away. That's something to keep in mind. We should probably get over here. And now... And this is a speed boost, which will be a little bit more helpful getting across this. You see, I jump a little more frequently. 
Just be careful not to fall off the edge like I did just there for a second. I have very good health. Never know. Flying the hole. You're moving, you're moving too fast, Sandy. Jeez. Look out! Guards! Sandy the speed demon. There we go. Hey, that door looks about to break. Hey, let's give it some help. There we go. We've broken the ooze drill. Let's climb. Now, yes, we will. I'm all the way to the top. Gotta recall our health. Here we go. I need it. Maxed out on our special ability. Let's keep progressing. Shoes all shiny, ready to go. And we're actually right here at the end, almost. It's pretty short. You bugs better give up. King Gorge will crush you all! Don't you see, Sergeant? You have been affected by the Mahu's ooze. You must resist, or we are all doomed. Ah, uh, shut up! Soon you'll be one of us, a loyal servant of the Mahu. One of us, one of us, one of us, one of us. One of us. There she is, and it looks like she's running out of time. Let's move! One of us! One of Huh? Oh! Okay! Alright, now I have a little bit of fighting to do. Oops. Kind of like a battle gauntlet, is what you're basically doing. How'd you know I was gonna go right there? But yeah, that scene right there with them, this is probably the number one thing. When I think of this game, that's the first thing I think of. Is this scene. With, uh, that just occurred. Great hit me. So, it's like I said, this is a boss gauntlet, basically. Oh, well, not a boss, but like, it's a battle gauntlet. It's destroy everything in your path. Alright, now I get the boss. You gotta beat him. Make sure every time you hit him, he's gonna swing like that. So let's be prepared for that. Otherwise, it's not too terribly difficult. And once he's dead, he's basically done with the chapter. There we go. The chosen ones. Then the legends are true. I should have believed Shelly all along. Shelly? Guys, there's an aqueous thermal diffuser not far away. We need that for the rib zipper. Look, it's over there. Wow, it's beautiful. Dude, it's an espresso machine. That's what I said. Oh my gosh, she made complicating she things. To stop the river flowing through the Florian's village. Now they can only drink the ooze, which makes them slaves to the Magu. It's an environmental apocalypse. How can we stop him? If you can distract the king long enough, my commandos can destroy the dam. The river will flow again, and the Florians will be free. Y'all want our help, Queenie? You got it! Thank you. When you are ready, come and talk to me. Alright, that's the end of the chapter there. So yeah, I'd like to apologize on, uh, kind of going to that chapter there and not saving. But that's alright. I uh, highlighted where everything was. There's not a whole lot in that chapter, just kind of some story development kind of stuff. Which I'm sure you guys wanted to see. And now we talk to the Mermec Queen. And apparently the, their king has been uh, corrupted by the ooze. We have to stop him. Actually, let's see if we upgrade anything since then. Oh, it looks like we got enough for Timmy's outfit. Um, we got enough crystals. Nice. Enough gears. We got all these four characters salvage items. They're really good. And yeah, we have three more levels up in the game to go through. One of them, one of them is a boss, actually. So we got five unlocks so far. We've got three more to do. We got one for Sandy, one for Timmy, and one for Squidward. Which, of course, I think we missed Timmy's. 
So we're not going to get Timmy, but we might we can still get Sandy's and uh, Squidward's. So for now, let's go talk to the Mercury. And there's, there's Danny's costume, because his costume is not done. Sweet. When uh, you are ready, Chosen ones, we are ready to leave. My commando bugs will carry you. That's some big commando bugs, jeez. <laughs> Dry Canyon Dam, Defeat the Florian's Mad King Gorge. Stop this madness! Release the water and save your people! <laughs> the so-called Chosen Ones! My master, the almighty Marku, who rules from the volcano, commands that all become one with the ooze! Submit! No way! We're ending this now! Not if I end you first! Uh, so we Sammy. Dodge it for a little bit. So big one comes up. And just destroy it. We're gonna do that for each of his tentacles here. Keep moving, it shouldn't have any problems. And we see the big shadow. Destroy that one. First phase, not. And now we can climb up him now. So that's all we gotta do, we gotta keep distracting him, keep hitting him. Actually, he'll throw us back, and we gotta do it all over again. And he'll be a little bit more tougher now. Our speed boosts me up absolutely no problem dodging him. But now he's gonna start spitting at us like an artillery bombshell. And if it hits you, you get stunned for a little bit. It makes it really easy for him to hit you. There we go. Okay, spit some more. Or dodging. If you're really have dodging and stuff, this this battle shouldn't be too bad. There we go. I don't know why, but every time I saw this boss, he looks like a giant cabbage. <laughs> every single time I fight this boss, it's like, oh shoot. I should've got hit there. This is hilarious every time I see it. Almost defeated. Thanks to you, our people will have peace once more. Please, you must stop the Magu. He is the cause of all this evil. Perhaps this will help you. That's it! This is the last doohickey we need to finish the Rip Zipper. Now we'll show that Magu who he's messing with! Indeed. Our second boss of the game.
Not terribly difficult. But now we can challenge the Magu now. Take him on and free his island from its torment. Alright. And so the next so that'll be the end of this episode. Um we'll check our rewards and see what anything new we got, and then let's go talk to Tucker. So let me anything really new on this screen. Yeah, this level is all done now. Nothing new there. Um, any costumes? We need the Crash Nebula costume for Timmy. I think that's about it though, and that's probably all we're gonna get, because there aren't too many collectibles in the last bit. And really the last level there aren't, there's a lot of crystals, there's not a whole lot else. So, next episode we'll go to the next level, we'll see what it is. Ooh, look at that, we've got Magu up there, he's getting really, really intimidating up there. I'll see you guys then!